right, y'all, we are back with some more wisdom from Coach Ducky, and he's going to be talking about the hardest part of being a champion, man. So, yeah, let's just jump straight into it, y'all. You have to face reality that this is not the end. If you mm. really want to stay on top, you have to do the job. Hindi ta sapat na nanalo ka lang. You have to maintain that championship mindset of yeah. performing at the highest possible level every time that you show up for a tournament. Yeah. Hate me. You know, I said mm -hmm. what I said. Onik lang ang meron nun. Uh, Onik Indonesia lang pare yung merong uh, uh, macro skill that is pretty reminiscent of Filipino teams. Okay. Right now, ang ganda ng performance sa international stage ng Onik Indonesia. Yeah. And I hope, you know, with all these imports na dumarating ngayon sa Indonesia, yeah, no? Oh, okay. Sana maging, maging ganun at the same time. Kasi it brings, it brings, uh, you know, it brings out the best in both regions. Eh. Yeah. Kapag ka nandun na yung certain level of competition. That's why I really love playing yung team ni Yeb, team, mm. yung mga teams na high-performing <laughs> pagdating dun sa ano. Kaso talo kayo. Ay! Uh, hey. Hindi ito. Mga teams na high-performing <laughs> pagdating dun sa ano. Kaso talo kayo. Except we'll win. Ay! <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> hey. Nagdagulit na lang ito, ako. Nagutom na gutom na ako. No, no bullshit. Pero I really feel bad kay Yeb at saka kay Kyrie. Mm. Particularly kay, kay, ano, kay Kiboy kasi... I really want the kid to yeah. win. Kasi I, I honestly feel that Sigiboy is one of the most deserving players to win hmm. an M series. <coughs> I really like the Ugali temperament of Sigiboy. I don't know, ako lang hata, but I just want to as a player. Hmm. Uh, before I have a, my favorite player in Indonesia, was wrecked. You know, favorite uh, player ko kasi sa Indonesia is Sigiboy. Hmm. So, yun. Sempre no pare si Gary. Oh. Ano pare yung ating bata si Gary. Oh. Uh, pero ma mapapa pa ma mapapatawad naman siguro ako ni Gary kung sabihin ko na si Kiboy yung ano ko. Kasi alam naman ni Gary oh, well, uh, I really respect him as a player and I, I think he's one of the best junglers right now. Pero for me right now it's Kiboy. Yeah. So yun. I I I felt really bad para kay Yeb kay Gary. Mm. Kasi kaibigan ko siya, mm. si Gary kaibigan ko din. <laughs> So I felt really bad because yeah. I know for a fact they're they're really deserving. Pero isa lang kasi yung pending manalo eh. Yeah. 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 I said, sabi ko ngayon. Kung sino yung deserving uh, Sabi ko nga, Yeb, sorry pare, kami, kami muna. Siguro... Mm. Pero kami muna, uh, dalawa ka na. <laughs> <laughs> May, pero alam mo, ano siya yung pagkatalo na yun. I mean, walang rason ha, walang rason. Mm. Kahit, uh, yung, yung taon na yun kasi, yun lang yung talo namin. <laughs> tama, tama. Yung, yung, yung talo ano? namin. Um, kahit anong gawin ko na maging, ano mo yun, maging humble lang yung team ko. Minsan nahihirapan na ako umangat silang sabay-sabay. Mm. Kailangan ko yung ibaba ng ibaba. Ako, sarili ko. Uh. Siyempre, ititignan ko rin sarili mm. ko. Eh. Ano ba? Susundan ako ng mga to eh. Agahin uh. ako ng mga to eh. So, kailang, ang dami kong gets nyo. Mm. Minumonitor na dapat. Sobrang ano pa rin tayo. Yeah. Kasi sabi ko nga sa kanila, Siguro mag-agree naman si Dax dito. Isang goal mo mag-champion. Mm. Pero ang pinaka-goal mo talaga pag nag-champion ka na, panatiliing nasa taas ka. Mm. Yeah, for sure. Kasi yun yung pinaka-mahirap. <laughs> yun, mm. pare. Kailangan, kailangan na kailangan mo silang, ito, medyo pangit pangit yun, pero kailangan mo silang hilahin from yeah, yeah, pababa sure. muna. Kailangan sure. mo muna hilahin pababa yung players mo kasi they're really up there in the cloud cloud yeah, nine yes. kailangan mo silang paan nila nasa lupa muna yeah and kasi uh, so the players think too highly of themselves it starts to mess with their minds and and hinder their work ethic and and then they also spoke spoke a little bit about how getting the payments that they get and stuff like that the size of the money coming in they're comfortable as well so they they win most of the time. They got all this money coming in. It's like there's really no incentive for them to really be champions. Like they don't. What reason do they have to really want to be champions enough? And that's that's the tough part here because it's like, yeah, what what reason do they have to want to be champions enough? Uh, maybe they're not cut out for it if they don't want it that bad. Like they should want to win more than anything, even more than the money. And I don't know. I know Kyrie has a, a, a publicly said that he he's just in it for the money, which nothing wrong with that. I would be too personally, like. But I mean, hey, you need some people with true passion to just go hard and be the best, you know. Baba muna, kila mo muna hilahin pa ba yung players mo sa they're really up there in the cloud cloud yeah, yes. nine. Kailangan mo silang paan nila na sa lupa muna. Yeah, because <laughs> they have to face reality that this is not the end. If you mm. really want to stay on top, you have to do the job. 
hindi ta sapat na nanalo ka lang you have to maintain that championship mindset of yeah. performing at the highest possible level every time that you show up for a tournament yeah yeah that's a fact so dang so that's the hardest part of being a champion maintaining that champion mindset I mean, I can imagine that's tough, man, because this is a mental game. Everything is mental. Like, it's all about your mind. So, yeah, let me know what you all think in the comment section down below, man. How do you all feel about that? Do you all agree? Do you disagree? Let me know. Be sure to drop that thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out, fam.